It's Jill Hindley about Boston here at the Jimmy Fun Scooper Bowl once again for our coverage, our 2012 coverage of the Scooper Bowl. This is the nation's largest all-you-can-eat ice cream festival, and it is such a fun event. It lasts for three days. It's always falls Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and it goes from uh, all afternoon, actually. starts at noon, and it re truly is uh, a very touching event in that people come, ice cream lovers, and you know all sorts of kids as well as older people and everyone in between uh, they get their spoon when they walk in and then they can use their spoon the whole time that they're here and try over 30 different flavors here today it's also a touching event because a lot of people have a personal connection to Dana Farber and really and want to raise money for the Jimmy fund last year in 2011 50,000 people attended the Jimmy Fund Scooper Bowl and it started as just a New England Dairy Association event to get people to come in and learn a little bit about farming in New England. But now it's turned into a main uh, Dana-Farber fundraiser, and it has actually raised over $3 million for Dana-Farber and for the Jimmy Fund over time. There's many different dairies here. We're going to go out and talk to vendors. We're going to talk to patrons who are just here to eat ice cream. We're hoping to talk to a couple volunteers as well. And then once we do, have done our rounds, we are going to eat ice cream as much as we want. I'm here with Peter from the Franklin Elementary School in Newton, and he brought a group in from an after-school program. Is this your first year that you guys come into the Scooper Bowl? They've come. This is the first show I've come. I think you guys came last year, right? This is my we first year here. We came last year, um, and um, the year before. I think we've gone to the Scooper Bowl ever since the Pasha has been open. Yeah, I think, I think he's right. I think they come every year. All right, and they're yeah. very busy eating their ice cream, as you can see. <laughs> So guys, what's your favorite flavor so far? Have you have you just gotten started or have you been here a while? We just got here. We just got here. Is this your floor. first cup? Yeah. 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 Right, so I'm done. So you look like you've got, you've got cotton candy. What's your flavor? Chunk a chunk of peanut butter fudge. Chunk a chunk of peanut butter fudge. I know that's from Friendly's. Anyone else have something different? Oh, um, Owen has um, um mint. It's mint. Mint chocolate chip. Mint chocolate chip. Awesome. All right, so you guys, these guys come in every year from Newton and and participate in this and. But to me, I like it so much. It's saving some for later. Awesome. And we have. What do we have to say about the Celtics tonight? Anyone? Go Celtics! There you go. Go Celtics! Yeah. Big game. All right. Thanks, guys. We're here with Michael and Lexi, who are Scooper Bowl patrons here, clearly from the amount of cups they have, empty cups they have. Um, Michael, where are you from? I'm from East Boston. East Boston, Lexi? I'm from Lowell. Okay, so you came all the way down from Lowell. Cool, and how many years have you been coming to the Scooper Bowl? This is my fifth or sixth year coming to the Jimmy Fun Scooper Bowl. Okay. And it's my first time. First time. So you're, you're a newbie. And what, how many, oh, well, I guess you we can count them. Have you had about, what, eight? I think I'm on nine right now. Not really sure. Nine or ten. And what's your favorite flavor so far? Um, I'd have to say lemon poppy from Soco from Creamy. Soco Cream. Okay. Behind us, and how about you, Michael? That's uh, three out of these nine cups are the lemon poppy You're seeds. Kidding? Yeah. You're repeating the same yeah. flavor. Yeah. That's so. impressive. It's really good. <laughs> it must be good. All right, I'm gonna try that one. I'm here with Don, and he seems to have some sort of record going, at least from what we've seen today. How many cups have you had? Twenty-one. Wow, twenty-one. I'm impressed. I was here earlier. So. <laughs> Where'd you come from today, Don? Medford. 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 <laughs> so 21 cups, and what's been your favorite flavor so far? Um, I like the um, chocolate therapy and the... Chocolate therapy, That's I heard the, of that. Um, what do you call it? Dolce de leche. Okay. Oh, the dolce de leche, yep. Yeah. Um, which is, uh, that's Edie's. And is chocolate therapy belong to what, Ben and Jerry's? I guess. Oh, okay. Okay. okay, awesome. Well, thanks for chatting with us. And good, you're going to try, you're going to keep going, though. You're not done at 21, I hope. <laughs> no, no.
<laughs> spread it out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. I'm here with Tiana, who works for SoCo Creamery, obviously. And where is SoCo um, headquartered? Where is it located? In Great Barrington, Massachusetts. It's oh. up in the Berkshires. Yeah. Okay. Great Barrington. Oh, that's neat. And how many years have you been working for SoCo? Is uh, this is my second year. Yep. And it sounds like from what um, Tiana told us is that this is the second year that SoCo has come to the, um, the Scooper Bowl. Yep. Tell us a little bit about the flavors that you brought this year. This year, we tried to change it up a little bit. We brought um, salted caramel, lemon, lemon poppy seed cake batter and mission fig yeah wow, those are funky yeah like really in the salted caramel reminds me of a starbucks drink yeah so that yeah that's great and i um we just talked to a couple um repeat scooper bowl ice cream lovers and they said the lemon poppy is the best one here out of the whole thing Awesome. I like to hear that. That's awesome. So awesome. Well, Great Barrington, Massachusetts is represented here, and thank you for your time. Thank you very much. So I'm here with Lee and a big group of, of school kids from Newton. What school are you from, Lee? We're the Cabot After School. Okay, after school program, and you guys are here to what? Eat ice cream? Yeah! yeah. Is this the first year that your after school program has come in for it? Uh, we have not been here for a long time, so okay. uh, maybe 10 years. Oh, okay, so it, you took a little, it's been 10 year break, and now you're back. So everybody tell me, what was your favorite flavor? Have you, have you tried a bunch of different ones already? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> so favorite flavor, go. <laughs> All right, go. It's the chocolate therapy. Chocolate therapy, which is funny, I've heard about that one. I liked American Dream. Oh, cool, what is it, the vanilla? It's like vanilla, vanilla caramel, caramel, and waffle beans. cones. It, I, I like Amer it's Americone Dream, okay. so I like that one too. Americone. How about favorite? My favorite. Um, my favorites are Americone Dream and Chocolate Therapy. No, chocolate yeah. Therapy. Chocolate yeah. Therapy. Alright, anyone have anything different? Vanilla bean. Vanilla bean. Oh, you might like be a coffee person. Uh, I like the cotton candy with Pop Rocks. Okay. Cotton candy with Pop Rocks. Splish Splash. Splish Splash? What's in the Splish Splash? I think it's raspberry and lemonade or something. Oh, okay. oh wow. That's crazy. Raspberry lemonade ice cream. Cool. Do you know what your favorite? Cake batter. Oh, that's a that's a new one. I haven't heard that one yet. How about you, Lee? I like the fig. The fig. I heard, yeah, SoCo, right? Yes. The so, okay. So cool. Well, thanks, guys. I hope you've had fun today. Who ate the most cups? Me! Thank you for your time. Have fun. All right. Bye. Thanks. <laughs> I'm here with Phil, one of the Jimmy Fun Scooper Bowl volunteers. And where'd you come from today, Phil? Oh, I came from Malden. Malden. Okay, not too far. And how many years have you been volunteering for the Scooper Bowl? This is my second year. Okay. And what? How did you get started with it? And you know, from the beginning. Well, uh, I have a friend, uh, Dick Dion, who uh, Dana Faber helped, and he's alive because of them today. So um, I do it for him. Yeah. You know, That's and, great. And so he's kids, and for the kids too. Right. For the kids that are being treated yeah, and cancer and is very difficult because I have a brother who died of leukemia. So, Sorry, yeah. yep. Okay. So it's it's very a very personal reason that you're here yeah. for your friend and in honor of your brother. Yes. So okay, great. Thank you so much for talking to us. Okay, you're welcome. Okay. This is Michael from Friendlies, and this is Friendlies' second year coming out to the Scooper Bowl. Michael, how many years have you volunteered? This is my first year. Okay, and where do you where did you come from today? Cape Cod. Oh, you drove up from the Cape. Awesome. Would you tell us a little bit about the flavors here that Friendlies is offering? Sure, we got four flavors here. The blue one is going to be the pop and rockin' our cotton candy. Oh. Okay, the red one, the pink one is strawberry. This one over here is going to be the hunk of chunk of peanut butter fudge. Hunk of chunk of peanut butter fudge. Have, this one in the back here is called Graham Central Station. Oh, that's cute. Yes. Very, very clever. Graham Central Station. All right, awesome. Well, the hunk of hunk of peanut butter. It's hunk of chunk of peanut butter fudge. Hunk of chunk of peanut yeah, butter fudge. Uh, that's a good name. Yeah. Are you are you in charge of naming these ice creams? <laughs> no, no. 
Um, he is. Oh, that guy. All right. Do you have a personal connection to the Jimmy Fund at all, or? No, we're just here to help out. To help out. That's and right. Donate your time. That's what it is. And I'm I volunteering and helping out people. Yeah. And then you're paying it back. And I know that I'm sure that Dana Farber appreciates that you you know spending your time and having friendlies come down now for two years in a row. Thank you, Michael. It's an amazing event. We love this. Oh, good. Thank you. Thank you. This is Karen, and she works for Burn Dairy, and this is Burn Dairy's first year here first at the year. Super Bowl. Yes, it is. It's our first year. We're very excited to be here. Great. And where where are you located? We're where in you Syracuse, have? New York. So you came a long way. We, 300 miles, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did. Okay. How did you get involved in coming to the Super Bowl? A uh, co-worker, ha uh, his daughter has cancer, um, and he brought her to Dana Farber. And he heard about the Scooper Bowl, and uh, obviously, being a dairy ice cream sale, we sell ice cream and milk. He uh, said, "Well, we need to get involved in this." So he uh, incorporated several of us from the dairy to come and help out. So that's what we—that's what we're doing here. So we're happy to be here. I, yeah, it seems like it. Everyone's, you guys do seem excited. And you think you'll come back again then? Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. And would you just tell us quick, Karen, about the flavors that you have today? You we have cookie you? dough, holy cow, holy cow, which is um, uh, one of our flavors that we came up with. It's a vanilla ice cream or peanut butter ice cream base with caramel swirl and peanut butter cups. And we have um, the, the cotton candy and the mint chocolate chip. Oh, that's classic. That's Which good. We um, actually sent uh, flavors to Dana Farber and had the children pick out their favorite flavors, and that's the ones they came up with, so that's what we brought. Okay, so that you set them down ahead of time and yeah. had the kids pick their top four. Right. My vote. Oh, that's a great touch. Yeah. So, well, thank you for talking You're to welcome. us, and enjoy the day. Thank you. You too. I'm here with Cassie and Dan from Fuse. Now, you guys aren't giving out ice cream, so what's the connection for you? We are here to give everyone a beverage to go along with our ice cream, and Fuse is um, a fun drink, and ice cream's fun. We have some spin art going on, too, so we just wanted to bring some more fun to the Scooper Bowl for the day. Okay, so this is your first year that Fuse has been? Yes, yes, absolutely, yep. You know, where did you guys come from today? How far away? Not very far, just uh, Newton. Yeah, Newton, too. Awesome. Yeah. So, yeah, there's all diff there's several different flavors. I happen to love Fuse, so I'm going to try my um, my orange mango right now. But do you guys have a connection at all to the Jimmy Fund, or you just figured you'd kind of add something? We've done other events with them before, so we like to we like what it's about, like the support. Yeah, so. absolutely. It's a great cause, so it's good being a part of it. Yeah. yeah. Well, thanks for your time. Enjoy Thank the you so much. Fuse. Okay, enjoy the fuse. Bye Thank now. You. I will. Woo. So it's been a great afternoon here at the Scooper Bowl, and this is just the beginning of the week. They're going to be here Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. There are so many yummy flavors of ice cream. So if you come down to the Scooper Bowl this year or even in the future, make sure you're ready to eat. <laughs> the Jimmy Fund supports the fight against cancer at Dana-Farber um, Cancer Institute in Boston, and it really helps to raise the chances of survival for both children and adults with cancer. And it was founded in 1948, the Jimmy Fund, and through the generosity of millions of people over the years, the Jimmy Fund has been able to save countless lives through both furthering cancer research as well as patient care. The Scooper Bowl alone has raised $3 million, um, so this is a really great event that combines both the fun of eating all-you-can-eat ice cream as well as a very important cause that people really care about so it is just a great time kids are here enjoying the ice cream and it's um it's a little bit cool and cloudy today it's not the it's not really ice cream weather but people are they don't care they're making the best of it they're stacking up their cups and we talked to one guy who was at 21 cups and he was like he seemed like he had just gotten going. <laughs> so it's again, it's um, it's so nice to be here, and we're gonna go and eat some more ice cream before we wrap up. So from City Hall Plaza at the 2012 Jimmy Fun Scooper Bowl, this is Jill Hindley about Boston.